Hey there guys, this is going to be a full tutorial on the Linus tool and uh, so the Linus tool is a vulnerability analysis tool for your system and you could find the tool in the application menu over here. If you are using Kali, you could find in the application and move on to the vulnerability analysis. You could find over here, you could uh, find here and if you are using Parrot, you can just go there and go to the vulnerability analysis section and find the tool. If the tool is not available, just enter this command apt-get install linus make sure the spelling is correct so this is the command to install the tool i have already installed the tool so i don't want to install it so this is the command make sure you enter and uh, install the tool let's see the blog post i have written so i have written a full blog post the blog post will be in the description box below do check it out and i've given who developed the tool and the develop uh, the tool developers are the Michael Bullion, and uh, it seems that he is running a company. I don't know whatever. And I've given the GitHub download link, and I've given what all the tool does. So the main thing the tool does is check for the vulnerabilities, and the system hardening it depends on the people who are who tries to harden after the uh, results we get. And uh, you could also see the useful comments I have given. And uh, by end of this video, I'm, I'm sure that you will be familiar with uh, the Linus tool and I've given the commands available. So the, in example one, what we are doing is how to install the tool and I have said you uh, said that how to install. Let's skip the example one and move to the example two. In example two, I'm just uh, entering this command that is Linus show which shows all the commands available. So let's go to the terminal. Firstly, let's do Linus minus minus hell and let's wait so we you could find the useful uh, commands and options over here now let me give clear for easier interface so linus show so once you've done this command you get the set of commands available in the linus tool by this time it should show so it has displayed all these so from now on you can just continue with uh, the commands you want or the details or the environment whatever you want you can just go with it so this is a useful command that line so which shows the all the commands available and let's move on to the next example in the next example we are looking for the particular commands so we are saying liner show command most of the time you will be using only the liner show command uh, command option so let me go to the terminal and enter linus show command and i don't know what it takes uh, i think i made a mistake over here in the spellings so make sure the spellings are correct uh, i forgot to enter the s so the commands okay So we could find the commands over here the show commands so this is the most important command you will be using the uh, using in liners most of the time you will be using let's move on to the next example in the next example now onwards we are doing a quick uh, quick vulnerability testing that is we are saying the liner system audit minus quick so for you will be wondering what is the system audit or the minus quick let me explain by opening the uh, help help option let's enter linus minus minus help so you could find the linus audit over here also in the linus show command you could find the linus audit so audit is nothing but it uh, displays the um, it just goes through with your system and displays the vulnerability it has found that's it about that and you could also find uh, the commands over here in the command only these are important make sure you are uh, very well uh, known with this now you know what the uh, show is which shows all command and you can also uh, specifically show a particular command you want and the show version is nothing but it shows the version of the linus the show help i have already done it linus minus minus help is the sh uh, which shows this help uh, options and now let's move on to the audit system so what we are doing here is Linus system audit. So let's 
enter Linus system I think audit I guess I'm, I'm not sure with the spellings and the gap so this is a command to uh, do a vulnerability analysis on your system internally so if I give enter it will go through so I made a mistake over here Linus uh, audit system I guess audit system uh, yeah let's give enter yeah it has started the commands but I don't know why the command didn't work Let's go to these um, blog post and check for the screenshot. I'm not sure. I will. Uh, I'm not using this uh, this tool, Linus tool, um, most of the time, so I'm not familiar with this tool. But I'm still learning uh, on the Linus tool. So as you could see here, it has worked. Yeah, I have made a mistake in the commands. So the audit should come first, and the system should go back. We could see in the screenshot over here. I have changed the command so by if you're viewing this video uh, I will just change the command by now if you go and check it the command will be changed so by now you can see this uh, scan has started so what it go, uh, does is it's uh, checking for the operating systems and it's checking for the parts and checking for any vulnerabilities are available so that's it about this and you can just use this tool uh, for useful purpose, just uh, uh, you can use this tool to find any vulnerability in your Kali machine or any Linux machines. So, if you next, let's move on to the example 5. In the example 5, we could see I've entered Linus show test USB minus 100, sorry, minus 1000. So, which is I'm doing a particular scan on the USB 1000. So, uh, there will be ports in uh, there will be show ports in your computer or the laptop so you are doing a particular vulnerability on this port you can do this by linus show command linus show commands so let's uh, do a linus show test test yeah sorry here also I made a mistake. Make sure it is no, it is not test. It is test. Make sure you add the S. Yeah. Now it is here. Now specifically you can do a vulnerability scanning. So it is a big row coming over here. So let's uh, move on all the way down. So this is a command to uh, just uh, find the, uh, if you want to do a specific vulnerability scanning, you can use this command and find what you want to do, uh, on which you want to do a specific scan. Let's move on to down and let's find anything we could do a vulnerability scanning. So I'm using the USB 1000, just copy it. So what I'm doing here is, I'm doing a vulnerability a scan on this particular USB 1000. You could also see some of the description given here. Check if USB storage is disabled. And uh, you could also do this one. Check the presence of available IDS IPS tooling. I have not gone through all of these description. If you have time, you can just go through it. So what I'm doing here is just saying Linus. Linus show sorry show test and enter the particular title that the title is nothing but uh, the left thing you could see this one I'm talking about so once you're done just give enter let's wait for the results So it has uh, displayed the results and we could find the description over here. It says that check if USB storage is disabled and the category it comes through security and the group storage is of course and the operating system we are using as and there is no problem with the USB 1000. By this you could go through all of these uh, 
these things available or if you want to do a full scan as I did in the first command you can just do Linus system audit and uh, you could do minus quake you would see in the command uh, I have added the minus quake minus quake is nothing but um, making the uh, scans little bit faster so it will take nearly the scan will take to complete nearly 5 to 10 minutes so you have to wait comparing to that I will do um, comparing to the full scan I will do this particular scans so that's it about this let's move on to the next command let me close this so that's it I have reached if you have any doubts related to the Linus tool you can ask me in the comment section and if I know I will surely answer so that's it about um, the Linus tool and if you really like this video make sure you give a like and subscribe to our channel and also do check my blog post and you could see over here I've written many blog posts and there are many yet to come the web publication vulnerabilities then comes the password cracking I am really working on the password cracking tools and uh, soon the blog post of the password cracking and much more will come and I'm also writing the python languages uh, so do check in see you next video guys